Okay, you've got your awesome background created and you're ready to start animating. Uh, and you notice there's a big area over here where your picture got cut off. Like, what's that all about? Well, you create your background size. Pivot doesn't do this yet. It did do this before. I'm sure it's a future update. Peter, hear me. Uh, when you load a background um, before, it would adjust the size of the pivot to the background. Um, there's probably a reason why that isn't being done, but all you got to do is just go to Edit Options. We spent all that time creating the perfect size, so let's set the pivot to the same size, 1280 by 720. And say OK, and now look at that. It all fits within that dotted line and all the magic good things are about to happen with your animation not being cut off. So it's important you spend all this time making your background to make sure that it's the right size and pivot. And you can change that at any time um, you want. Uh, so there you go. Hope that helps. Peace.